Hi guys, this is my review of the Angry ROM for Galaxy Note GT N7000. So this ROM is based on the Android 4.1.2. Okay, there you go. That's the 4.1.2 Jelly Bean. And this is the Angry ROM from the Revenge team. So follow the method from the link one to install this ROM. So coming on to the review now, you do get all the features of the Jelly Bean like the ink effect, smart rotation, smart stay, multi window, air view, motion controls, pace buddy. So I'm coming to it in detail within a minute. So right from the lock screen, you have the CRT off animation. Okay, there you have it. And you also have this ink effect with this ROM and it's really really smooth, no lags, you can see it really fast. So you also have shortcuts on your lock screen which can be directly opened from the lock screen just by swiping the app up so that will open up that app okay there you have it and you can customize these apps from the setting menu and under the lock screen and lock screen options so you can change the shortcuts from here so with this rom you also get this awesome beats works perfect with the play music right over here and also with the Apollo music player so in case if you get any crashes with the Apollo music player just uninstall it and reinstall it again so that will solve your issue so the camera is also working fine there you have it you can take full SD videos 1080p videos so the camera is working fine even you have this S-Voice with this ROM works perfect double pressing the home button will launch the S-Voice ok there you have it works fine and the Google now works as well there you have it you also have add away Google currents flipboard the paper artist as well works fine you can see it yep works really fine you also get this photo editor generally you need to download this photo editor from the samsung app store but it's available by default with this rom you also have uh, playbooks play movies you also have this s note works fine no issues really fast no lags it works so all the spend functions works as well you know scraping any area you can, and yep you can just share it with any of these apps okay taking the screenshot now And there it goes. So all the S Pen functions works perfect. Even the multi window and the air view works fine. Just to show you. So Okay, there you have it. The AV works fine. There's no issues there. Okay, and the multi window works as well. Also, you have this titanium backup. You get this app by default with this ROM. You also have this Explore app, it's a file manager. So, all the apps are working fine. All the functionalities that you get with the phone, like the Wi Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, Play Store browser s pen functions works fine even the smart rotation just to show you just a second okay even you do get the smart rotation and the smart stay and it's working fine i have tasted it you also get the density display option with this rom that means you can change the resolution of your phone whether you can go with the phone mode that's the 320 dpi the tablet mode that's the 240 dpi 
So you need to uh, select this uh, fablet. You should check this uh, fablet mode while flashing this ROM in the ROM installer. You also have the space buddy, so it's working. So just to show you, okay, the space buddy is working now. You also can customize this notification panel from menu settings under display options. You have something called notification panel, and you can add additional toggles from here. So all the motion controls are working fine, no issues. So the ROM is really, really fast, really smooth, really stable, almost bug free. So you can say this is one of the best Jelly Bean ROM for Galaxy Note GT N7000. The ROM is really fast, you know, you don't have any lags or any force closes, any issues. It's really smooth, really fast, everything is working fine. You do get all the Jelly Bean features. So the only one thing missing with this ROM is the face buddy for the S Pen. That's missing. Other than that, everything is available with this ROM. Isn't even the smart rotation is available now. Uh, the battery backup is really decent now. Six to eight hours for heavy users, and fifteen to twenty hours with moderate users, like with continuous Wi-Fi connection and automatic brightness. So that's the benchmark scores for this ROM. So I'll definitely suggest you to flash this ROM and let me know how you feel about it. So that's all guys, that's all about my review. Thanks a lot for watching, stay subscribed. Bye bye now and have a good day.